how many people are in the world? Oh, I got scanned already? Uh -huh. Wow. That's crazy. Okay, so tell me how that works. So you see that camera right over there? Uh-huh. So whenever you go down this last row around that last turn there, it takes everyone's temperatures as they're walking by. It'll show us either if they have a green square saying they're good. If they have a red square, we send them right there to our first aid station. Well, ain't that nifty. So it's so oh, all right, thank you. Well, hello, Disney Connections and fellow Disney freaks. In preparation for our trip to Disney World, we decided to come here to SeaWorld and get our theme park on. Try out our masks. Yeah, Walking in the heat. Yeah. So far, so good. All right. Hey, let's go into the park and see all the Halloween decorations. Woo! Uh, quite interesting coming in and, and having that uh, digital thermometer. camera thermometer. You like yeah. walk through it and they can tell your temperature. Mackenzie, you six feet. Yeah, there's all sorts of okay. notifications, reminders to be six feet, social distancing, all of that stuff. I need a social distance to the restroom. That is going to be my first stop as well. All right, so just like Disney World, we had to get reservations. And here I'm we go. Sorry, put a downer, but oh. my scanner just died. Oh, okay. Oh, all right. Scanner died. We got to move to the next I'm one. I'm really sorry. No yeah, worries. Yeah. Hopefully this one doesn't die. <laughs> if not, we get a free pass. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Same. Thank you. All right. Y'all you enjoy your day. Woo, we all made it. All right, here we go. So they said that you had to have your annual pass and your reservations, but they ended up only having to scan our reservations. Well, that's not a bad deal. Have you ever, have you ever thought um, of all the random stuff that SeaWorld does? Yes. <laughs> like just a, on the spur of the moment, Pirate show? Yeah. Of course it does. Again. Come on, Bone Brothers. A one, a two. You know what to do. Do do I've got you under my skin. Oh. How fun is that? Yeah. Is that is that like uh, SeaWorld's version of the cadaver dance? Yeah. Yeah. The bony bills. Bone brothers. Oh, is it the bone brothers? All right. So they've got some signage to let you know face coverings are required, social distancing, wash your hands, you know, all the pertinent uh, stuff to keep us safe. A little fall maze made out of uh, hay bales. That's kind of fun. Not only are we here today to uh, just figure out what it's like to be in a theme park during COVID times, but uh, we're also checking out all of the uh, fall 
Halloween decor here at SeaWorld. So they do a pretty good job here, um, you know, with such a small park right here in San Antonio. So who would have thought San Antonio would have a SeaWorld? Since we're kind of a distance from the sea. see they have uh, face covering relaxation zones so you can uh, pull down the face mask and get a breath of fresh air maybe your uh, glasses will stop fogging up although pro tip if you pull your glasses down just a little bit they fog up a little bit less so make sure that your glasses are not tight against your face and uh, that'll help them not fog up as much all right Carney all right, so it's only been about 30 years um, since I've played this, uh, but this game is bankable, and uh, I'm gonna try. All the people. I'm gonna try to break out yeah, you can. Um, the old Carney in me and win this game. So, wish me luck. All right, here we go. So is it one in win, two in win? Right there. One game is two balls. Okay. Two balls in the same game. Okay. All right. We paid for four, so he's gonna play two. I'm gonna play two. All right. Here we go. Oh. All right. You got the idea. Oh, that was it. All right. You know, the, the carny days uh, have escaped me. I'm out of practice. So. You did win me that gigantic. I did. Uh, I, did. I won you the gigantic GMU. Yeah, but they don't yeah. have that GMU. No. All right. Well, let's see what else there is at SeaWorld. Apparently somebody to took their mask off on the ride and uh, they've stopped it. Look at those little tiny feet up there. He must be tiny. Yeah, right? Or he's a far way away. Oh, here we go. Here we go. It's been a minute since we've been here. Trace, are you gonna ride? It's been a minute since we've been here, but uh, wow. They got a new coaster. So we're gonna go check it out. Are we tall enough? I think so. Okay. I don't know, right. I think I was kinda cool. All right, we gotta go check this out here. The camera 
was good. It's just the bag. I can hold the camera, but I can't put it in my bag. Here, I'll give it to mom. You can't have it on the ride, but you can have it in the station. It's just we can't have bags left unattended just so nobody steals anything. Right? I'll give it to okay, mom. So you can't leave it strapped to my. I'll give it to mom. To myself here? No, sir. Okay. Can't have the bag. They're gonna stop it and tell me to put it in my phone. rode the Texas Stingray um, and it's uh, modeled after a wooden roller coaster. It was pretty fun. Not quite Thunder Mountain, uh, but it was pretty fun. So I'd highly suggest it. Um, not allowed to have any bags. Uh, can't hold your sunglasses in your hand. They must be on your face um, or you put your sunglasses in the box. And uh, I wasn't about to put my sunglasses, uh, my Oakleys, um, in a box and not be able to see them so but uh all in all i'll give that you know seven eight out of ten not bad oh, i'm not scared is that another dollar hey we got a pretty duck out there look at that blue bill He's unique. Wow. In a good way. I don't want him to get offended by my remarks about his Miata. Wow. So, uh, goodness, I don't even know what to say. It's uh, sparse, boring. Sparse. I mean, sparse. here we are, in one of the busiest places usually of the park. Nobody here. And nobody out here. So. Interesting. And spectacular. There's hardly, I mean, there's a couple of scarecrows and some bales of hay. Right. And that's about it. I mean, I was kind of imagining, um, you know, lots of decoration. Yeah, like six flags. And uh, six literally, flags I, I think I could have decorated this whole park <laughs> um, by loading the back of my truck. Yeah. You know what we should do at Six Flags versus SeaWorld Spectacular? Hey, let us know Breakfast. in the comments below if you want to have, have a good. little SeaWorld versus Six Flags. So it'd be Spectacular versus Fright Fest. Yeah, which, you know, in the past, granted, we we are not uh, huge on the Spook Fest. There's some decorations there. <laughs> um, I, I loved I loved the uh, Spook Fest. I love breakfast. Um, but uh, she doesn't. Um, no, remember and, uh, when those clowns came after yeah, me? <laughs> with the chainsaw? Yeah, I didn't like that. No, I love yeah. that. I do want to say that well. these are the best masks that I've worn thus far. Yes, yeah. And they're, they're Oregon State Beaver they masks. Are. And they're so comfortable. Yeah. They go all the way around your head so they don't wrap around your ears. Yeah. They're yeah. great. I think these masks will be good for for uh, Disney World. I wish they'd make Disney World masks like this. Yeah, I that's think that's a good idea. But uh, yeah, I'm a little underwhelmed. Um, I don't know if it's uh, because of the lack of attendance. Huh. Well, I don't know. I think we should just sign her off right here. What do you think? Sign off. Yeah, so thank you for coming along with us. Uh, to SeaWorld. We uh, love the uh, new roller coaster, Stingray, Stingray, what was it called? The Texas Stingray. The it's Texas a wooden, Stingray. Um, wooden roller coaster. Totally love the new roller coaster. Uh, totally underwhelmed 
by the uh, spooktacular. spooktacular decorations. There's so, one. yeah. <laughs> Appreciate you being here on Disney Connections, where we're going to talk about all things Disney. Bye. Question one: What three elements make up an organization? What? I don't speak that language.